Most cops killed this year were murdered by armed white men. He feared for his life. That's the justification Darren Wilson gave for shooting unarmed teenager Michael Brown. And there's little wonder why Wilson feared for his life. This year alone, 39 police officers have been killed in the line of duty. Of that number, 36 were killed by an armed criminal. Just one was killed in a fistfight. This army soldier killed Constable Robert White after punching him in the face on Halloween. One was killed by vehicular homicide. And there was one case of a cop getting killed by his own gun. A deranged MRI technician had a mental breakdown at work and got the jump on the responding officer, David Smith. In our unscientific analysis of police officer murders this year, we found that 21 of the suspects appear to be white. Suspects such as white supremacists Gerard and Amanda Miller, who ambushed two police officers as they ate. Or teen killers Brandon Good and Alexandra Hollinghurst, who ambushed a cop in Florida. Or Eric Frain, who ambushed two cops and eluded capture for nearly two months. Nine of the cop killers appear to be Hispanic, and nine black. There was at least one Asian, and we couldn't determine the race of the other three suspects. When it comes to cop killers, white criminals appear to be overrepresented. They account for nearly 51% of police officer deaths this year, though they are just an estimated 38% of the incarcerated population. Did you miss a teacher sex story? Visit the Nastier Nice section on tomonews.net.